What's up, everybody? Go Burns! Doing a little Grand Theft Auto online because we got some uh, new vehicles. Yes, we do. We have this little three-wheeled creature, the Raptor. We're going to check this out. Plus, we have a new version of the Western Damon. We'll look at that in just a moment. But first, let's take this thing for a little spin and we'll see if there's a new free t-shirt. I don't know if there is or not. I went on the other uh, websites to see if there was any like uh, deals today. Because I'm guessing a new uh, bonus week is starting today. Ah, damn it! My bad. Uh, hopefully uh, I will not get a bill from the city of Los Santos for that. Anyway, so I didn't see any deals on any like um, like planes or helicopters or military vehicles as usual. I mean, but that could be implemented later on this morning. I honestly don't know, or later on today, this afternoon, whenever you're watching this video. Okay, so I'm going to run in here, and I'm going to see if there is a new unlockable t-shirt. If there is, we will check it out. If not, say la vie. Okay, I think there's a new hoodie. I think, like, with uh, last week, you got, like, a t-shirt for buying, which one was it? The Western Wolfsbane, I think. I think it's the Western Wolf Wolfsbane. But, hey, hey. Hey, I don't care about you and your texting. Go away. Leave me alone, bitch. All right, so anyways. You can call at any minute. Yes, you are. Okay? If you want if you want better, you got to find a, a better guy, okay? A better guy's going to treat you better than just call you up to have sex with you, okay? You have to be responsible for your own choices in life, lady. I'm just saying. Okay, so this is an interesting uh, vehicle. And I've seen real-life versions of this. And, I don't know, it's kind of like a hybrid between... Uh, I don't know, a car, a motorcycle, and uh, let's see what else could you say it is. Kind of like a reverse trike. It also has three wheels or maybe even kind of like an ATV. It's a very interesting vehicle. Now, I don't know if uh, it's worth getting. So let's look at the price tag real first for, the, for both these new vehicles. First off, for the Raptor. It is $648,000. There are the stats on it if you're interested in that sort of thing. Now, let's have a look and see if this thing has any customization. We'll look at the uh, price tag for the Damon in just a moment. I, mean, I don't know. I mean, it, it's different. So, I mean, if that's something you're into, if you want to have something a little different. But it is a sports car. So, I seriously doubt this is going to be like the best sports car ever. I don't see it like dethroning any of the top level sports cars. I don't see that happening. And I also don't see any customization, but it looks like there's a, a discounts on respray. So that's kind of cool. So we're going to go and put a secondary because it looks like you have the ability to put secondary coloring on your Raptor. Let's see. Where is my colors? All right, there we go. That's why I usually put on some of Janine's rides, my uh, Xbox One character for Grand Theft Auto Online. Yeah, that works. Okay, so you got a primary and a secondary character. I mean, primary and secondary uh, color for uh, your vehicle. And uh, paint jobs are currently discounted. Um, I don't see where the how much it is, but whenever you have that little indicator right here, that means there's a discount going on. Uh, but other than that, I don't really see any... Um, customization besides what you get so that's pretty much it for the uh, BF Raptor so far I'm not really impressed with the handling I gotta say that I don't know if it's a uh, better or worse than the um, Chimera or Chimera however you wish to pronounce it doesn't matter but I mean I guess hopefully I mean at the very least let's go look at something else real quick can you at least put bulletproof tires on this thing I mean, I don't know. I mean, this is not something I would use in a sports race. Because it probably would not win. It probably wouldn't handle as well as at least an allergy. Or, for example, a, a Masakro or a, a Jester. So, I guess it's just a car you can have for fun. Just because it, it's different, it's unique. And I like that. I like the fact that Rockstar is adding more unique, interesting vehicles and clothing and weapons and whatnot. I mean, especially since it's Halloween season. I would like to see some other shit too. Okay, so you can get bulletproof tires if you want on this uh, on the Raptor, as opposed to the uh, Chimera. And oh yeah, there appears to be a discount on uh, wheel types as well. So I don't know if there's any other discounts. There may be a few uh, pickled in or uh, peppered in. That's what I meant. I didn't mean pickled in. 
<laughs> Though I do like me some pickles. I love pickles. But there may be a few other discounts peppered into uh, this um, week's bonus thing. Whatever they're going to call it. And if there is a newswire, I'll link it below in the description section. I won't do another video. Because earlier I already did uh, my uh, latest episode of uh, Mafia 3. Because I'm doing the entire Mafia 3 Let's Play from start to finish. FYI. In case you were interested in that sort of thing. Feel free and check it out. We're up to uh, five episodes now. And I probably got a few more episodes to go before it's over. Because it's like... The gameplay is like... I think they said like 30 hours. I'm only up to like episode five. But I mean, each one of my episodes is like at least an hour long. So... Anyway, so I think the uh, hoodie is one of those limited edition unlockable items you can get. And I think you get it by getting the uh, Western Daemon. Now, there is a Western Daemon in the game that you can just pick up. But it has no customization and it has like a, like on the seat, it has like a Lost logo on it. What, Malik? I'll say it again. You should check out the Hey, goodbye. Stop telling me about this stupid computer, okay? Man, some people are just pushy. You know, he'd make, be a great telemarketer. <laughs> he would. This won't stop annoying you. Or, you know, one of these, uh, like, political op people they call, you know, you know, when you're having dinner to tell you about a political candidate. Anyways, the Western Daemon is $145,000. But I believe this Daemon is customizable. So that is the good thing. Because a lot of people, including myself, really like the Western Daemon. The downside is the current Western Daemon in the game is what it is. You cannot customize it. And if you're not a fan of the Lost, then you have to deal with having the Lost logo on the seat. But maybe if you don't like the Lost, you can see that as a symbolic thing. Like, fuck the Lost. I'm sitting on their logo. <laughs> Anyways, let's go check out these two sweet rides. And let me know below in the comment section, uh, are you even remotely interested in the Raptor and or the new version of the Western Daemon? Do you think $145,000 is a fair price for the Daemon? Yes, no. Let me know below in the comments. And I get the feeling that there's going to be other vehicles because it's our other YouTubers have already found other vehicles. And it doesn't really surprise me because of the simple fact that Rockstar has been doing this for over a year now. You know, they put a, a DLC up and then along with the DLC, they put hidden content they put out over the following weeks. All right, so there's different sissy bars you can choose from. Kind of cool. Then, of course, uh, see mud uh, guards. Then uh, these. All right, so you can put some different types of mirrors if you want. It's not as, I like that. You know, practical mirror. It's not crazy like the Fazio's mirror Scott. All right, so you have different seat options too. Different colors, looks, feels, vibes. Whatever your heart desires. I think I would keep it as is. Oil tanks. You can change up the oil tank, as you can tell. Then, of course, the uh, fuel tank. You can go, eh. You know, I like, I kind of like, the irony is I kind of like the build that the Damon has already. So you got the different, you know, drive covers. Zoom in on that. All right, trying to get a good angle here. Yeah, that's not bad. I mean, basically the same as a lot of the other, you know, motorcycles. But it's cool that there's these options now in the game. All right, some different shifters. All right, let's see what else we got. The basics engine, exhaust. Okay, we got different exhaust options. All right. Not bad. Some basics. And yeah, nothing too crazy. Kind of cool. Not too shabby. So that's the that's the main that's the basic one. So if you want to go a little bit more badass, you can get some bigger pipes if you want. It's just your call, whatever you desire. All right, next, uh, libraries. Let's check out the libraries. So, yeah, I think these are the same libraries that you're going to see on some other bikes in the game now, courtesy of the bikers update. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, these are some of the um, same libraries. But it's cool to have some different library options to choose from, obviously. Okay, so those are all the libraries. Let's see if there's anything else. We'll check out Respray in a minute. Um... Let's see, what else do we have? Okay, the only other thing we have is a uh, respray. So, I mean, what the fuck? Respray. Okay, primary and secondary. So you have a primary and secondary color. And we'll go to here and we'll check it out. 
Alright, so this is what the uh, secondary color affects. That's kind of cool. Yeah, so there you have it. That is the Western Daemon. The customizable version of the Western Daemon. All part of the Bikers update. Just released today. A week after the Bikers update, but don't be surprised if you see other vehicles uh, being doled out in the next couple weeks. Maybe even some Halloween stuff as well, because Halloween is only a few weeks away. So, between the two, which one do you like more? Do you like the Raptor? Do you like the Daemon? I think since the Bikers update is geared mostly towards Bikers, I get the feeling that the uh, Western Daemon is going to be a lot more... Um, I guess the option that gamers are going to be picking. I don't know where I was going with that, but anyways. I think that most of the gamers are probably going to want the Damon. A, it's a little bit cheaper. And uh, B, I don't know. I mean, the Raptor seems different. There's a unique quality to the Raptor. But if you're into like a top-of-the-line sports car, I would suggest something else. But I mean, it's I guess it's a fun little ride. It's something that people are going to get. And they're going to play with. And eventually the novelty for the Raptor will probably wear off. Because even though it's in the sports category. It's just. It's not going to be any match. For the LG. Or fuck. God damn it. For the LG. Or the Massacro. Or the Jester. And if there is uh, more vehicles that gets uh, put out in the following weeks. I will be sure to cover those as well.